Before installing the complete upper body and stem conversion kit, perform a visual inspection, ensuring proper height and good access to the hydrant. Close the secondary valve to shut off the water supply. Open the hydrant to release any residual water pressure. Remove the hose cap and verify that there is no water flow. Remove the weather cap screws. Now remove the bonnet, noting the sequence of parts for reassembly. Insert the interior wrench. Thread the holding nut onto the upper stem. Draw the hydrant to the closed position to prevent damage to the drip lever. Unthread the main valve seat by turning counterclockwise. Remove the interior wrench and holding nut. Lift out the stem assembly safely. Rest the spider coupling on top of the hydrant and regrip. Remove the hose and pumper caps to reduce weight. Loosen the bolts and remove the flange segments. Remove the upper body. Gently rock back and forth to break the seal. Remove old gasket material. Position the new gasket. Replace and align the new upper body. Attach the new flange segments. Prepare the new stem assembly for installation. Higby cut threads are self-aligning. Lubricate with food grade grease. Insert the new stem assembly. Thread in the main valve seat by turning clockwise. Insert the interior wrench. Now thread the holding nut onto the upper stem. Draw the hydrant to the closed position to prevent damage to the drip lever. Tighten the main valve seat. Remove the interior wrench and holding nut. Position the new gasket and bonnet assembly. Tighten the bonnet assembly leaving a quarter inch gap to allow for easy alignment. Insert bolts into the bonnet assembly. Close the hydrant fully to engage the gasket. Now tighten the bolts. After lubricating, insert the lubrication screw. Attach the hose and pumper caps. Open the secondary valve. Now open the hydrant and check for leaks.